Welcome back everybody to Pumpkin Days. This is episode 188 at Wahoo Beach with Zora and we are heading on outside to see what the day might bring. What's in our backpack? Herbs. I need to really do something about that. Let's go, let's go through the herbs in the herb bridge with the exception of the ginger because we've got to go find that last bit of ginger for, um, uh, for whoever it was I was finding it for. Let's just sort that up. And put everything across. Where'd the ginger go? Oh, I might have more ginger in here. I had one ginger. We don't need to go searching for it. That is awesome. Alright, looks like... Oh, it's reckon they're not basil. Wow, alright, we need to, um, to really do some grinding, I'm afraid. Yeah, we do. We need to grind up a bunch of herbs. Ah, and a bunch of curry. Right, we'll start with what's in our pack and we'll just work our way through that. We'll just renew it every time we go past it. And we'll do the same with the windmill. Only I think I might focus on... Um, we might focus on... Wheat. There we go, I can so to you find the words. Might focus on the wheat for the wheat flour. Let me just grab four more of these. Because at the moment there's only 25 in each of these things. I think actually I should have gone and grabbed two more if I never mind. There we go. Alright, so that's going to finish its thing. We now have the 10, 10 ginger that we need. And it is an even day. It is the last day of fall. Let's send our animals inside. Let's have a quick look in the barns for our, if there are any foals or anything arrived. Inside. No foals. I'm pretty sure I bred everyone though, so I'm not sure what's going on. Or maybe, maybe I've got a couple more episodes to go. That's fine. Let us. I know. Are you stuck, Licorice? There you go. Now you're not stuck. Don't let the gate hit your butt on the way through. Oh, we forgot to put the wheat in the, in the, um, in the windmill. What is in there at the moment? Yeah. Okay, it looks like rice. So, we're going to grab two batches of wheat and pop those in. Get ourselves a hundred bags of flour, that's a good start. We've got enough to make a couple of thousand bags of flour, so we're pretty good. Um, I actually looked up, there was a, someone answered my t-shirt question ages back. I even missed I even missed a question from the dead way, way back a year ago. I didn't even realise I had. So um but I went to look at where the secret t-shirts were and have a look at some of the clues that have been given and discovered I'm kind of on the right track when it comes to flowers. I'm kind of on the right track when it comes to timber. I just haven't shipped enough. All right, shipping 2,850, 25,871, and 66,200. I wish I knew which boxes they were for. Now, what are we doing? I know, I've, I've lost the plot. Completely lost the plot. <laughs> Ah, delivery for Clara. Let's go and at least get that on time. You know what, we might actually wander around Wahoo Beach and look after our relationships while we're here. Let's do that too. Uh, what are we at? We're at Nikki. Nikki who likes chocolate pudding. Let's whistle up a pony. I know, because I don't feel like... Smoky? There you go. Actually, this time of day, is it Nikki in the post office? Yeah, there she is. Grab out our chocolate pudding. We might catch her before she leaves for a change. Hi! Whoa, cool! You're very welcome. Oops. I'll get back, get rid of it. Wow, this is amazing! This just made my day super extra awesome, Slowpoke. Yo! Uh, I don't think I ever said thanks a ton for being so cool and junk with me. I'm glad to have you as one of my super besties. Yo! How's it going? I did. Okay, so she says it twice because it's important. Catch you later, Slowpoke. Does that mean we made it to the final level of friendship with her? No, we're a little bit to go. Let's go find a Kaya. 
and maybe dropping on flowers at the same time. Now I think a Kaya might be down at the, the fishing docks, maybe. Probably that, we'll just head on over to the cafe at 4 o'clock or it's the pub in the evening. But that looks like him, kind of there. And we know he likes his breadfruit mix, so we'll grab this. There it is. Hallelu and breadfruit meal. He loves it. Here you go. Something healthy fish. Dude, I love this kind of stuff. How do you know I love this? You're like the best friend ever. Surf's up, Gromit. Some surfers got a local zone you rule. What's the point? Well, if I was like that, we'd never have become buds. Make sure you don't get any dings on your board, Gromit. If you do, though, we can fix that up. Think about hitting those waves soon. I'll catch you later, Gromit. Alrighty, that's a Kaya. Eugene. Oh. Now, I know, maybe I'm just looking at all the wrong places for Eugene. It's 11.47. Let's see if we can find him. Alright. Oh, well, he's not in the barn. Nope, he's certainly not there. Let's zip it and die over onto his field. Oh, there he is! Man, that boy lurks in the trees. Right, so we've worked out so far that every ginger recipe we've made is something he likes. So let's see if he likes honey ginger salmon. Thank you. Oh, I see you've done your homework, Brignac. This is truly exceptional. Um, actually... Precisely on time. Work isn't over once the planting is done, Brainiac. There's much more to study to be done. Um, actually? It's quite satisfactory to see someone who's managed to create a farming system as efficient as my own. I appreciate it when people take true pride in their work. Um, actually? I'm certainly somewhere else to be, Brainiac. So that one was, the salmon was the one who got the least, the least friendship points. So I think the most came from the ginger mahi mahi, which is typical that boy has expensive tastes. Uh, who else are we seeing next? So that's Eugene. Jabala. Chicken recipes. So far he's liked our chicken recipes. Let's go give him some more. We found some more chicken for him. No. The, the one thing that I kind of need to do too is, is head around all of these different places and go in and see if I can trigger any cutscenes. How you doing? Perhaps Wahoo Beach could do with some waterborne flowers like lilies or lotus flowers. That would be so cool. I wonder how difficult it would be to get something like that going. I don't know, but I, I know that you would think better on a full stomach, so... Um, how do you feel about chicken and mushroom? Mm. Little mouse, you are too much. Our bond is strengthened greatly this day. 24 for mushrooms and chicken. Never mind. Go back to your tasks, little mouse. Alrighty, that's Jabala. Who else have we got? Haku. Meat dishes, Lamont, pork dishes. Alrighty. Let's go visit Haku. Because we have we have uh, more of that palalu and breadfruit. And I'm sure he'll like it. Because it's a festival meat dish. Just pop that away. Tasty. This is the best gift you could have given me. I'm ecstatic, Peanut. Oh, dear. Dr. Manaka is a really good doctor. Yeah, I'm a heavy guy, but I exercise and eat healthy. She says I'm in good health and I don't need to worry about my current weight. It's good feeling, you know? Oh, dear. And she says it twice. Because it bothers him. Oh, dear. I forgot to return this game to his area. I can do that for you. Thanks. Alrighty, let's go. Rosario is the hairdresser. He's reaching up another pad smokes. Who is on the corner here? Alright. Oh, what? Hey, shorty. Hope it's good enough. How you doing? We make some real positive energy together, shorty. I really appreciate your vibes. Wow, thanks. Okay. So, what are we doing now? So that was Haku, Jabala, 
Lamont and Dirt. Alright. So Lamont likes pork recipes and bacon and other stuff. So we will grab out one of these pork curries. Hopefully he likes curry as well. Let's find out the hard way. Here's some yes, lunch. Well, wow, howdy, young buck. Where'd you go and get that from? You're right. What do you mean, young buck? You don't think I haven't noticed you? You're putting in extra work around here. This is for you. Keep on that grind, you hear me? How you doing? Well now, people around these parts are taking a liking to you, young buck. Better not go and let him down now. Do you need anything? A bird a thing from Joel. Sure, I can do that. Thanks. Alright, I know. Joel, Joel the jewelry lady. Let's go. Oops. I know Mike is gonna give me a speeding ticket one day. Wouldn't that be funny? You're riding through Wahoo Beach and Mike gives you a speeding ticket. Hey Joel. Oh, you borrowed it from Jade? Alright, I'll see if I can find her this time of day. Alright, uh, Jade, wasn't it? Who is not at work yet. Uh, I think she might actually be asleep. Let's just get a half a clue as to where she might be. Oh boy, that was not expected. Hey, Finn. Okay. She's normally up and around early in the morning and then she goes and crashes for a bit. I haven't delivered this thing to Clara. Let's go do that without falling off the edge. Alrighty. Hey, Clara. You borrowed it from Lamont. Man, you couldn't have told me that before I went and gave him stuff. Wow, thank you. Oh, is it your favourite? Who knew? This is so funny. What a surprise. I asked around and found your favourite out. Yeah, sneaky, sneaky townsfolk. Don't ask me how I know this. I told you I'd have to kill you. Okay. Love is delivery. You part it from Jabala. Sigh. I know. They love they love making you run these guys. Uh, now Jabala at four o'clock in the afternoon is probably having a chat with Govin down the front here. So we'll just grab this. Zippity doodle our way this way. Or he hasn't left his flower shop yet and is about to. Oh man, did you do that, Smokey? Indeed, you should hang your head in shame, pony. Pooping on the beach. Alrighty. Don't look at me. I know I'm the one who operates the shovel, but seriously, there he is. Hi. You borrowed it from Finn, who is in the cafe. How many passes is this so far? So it, was, it was Clara is the first one, to Lamont is the second one, to Jabala is the third one. Let's see if we're fourth time lucky. Thanks! <laughs> Excellent! You're so cool! I got something I want to give you. Someone gave this to me, but I so don't like wearing clothes. So... Hi! Hi! I can smell the fish that Haku's cooking from here. It smells so good. A and bad. And good! Fishy fish, what can I say? <laughs> oh, there's a princess with a conduit. Alrighty. So I, I keep saying we've got to go and get this ginger up to who was it? Someone up in Diamond Falls. So why don't we go and do that before we forget? So Diamond Falls. Travel. Yes, please. And um, we'll just hop off the pony and hop back on because otherwise it looks weird. Check out Erin's Catherine. And then we'll head on back down to the bar at Wahoo Beach and drop this off to the barkeep. Oh, now where is Catherine? Let me just highlight that mission. There we go. She's coming back up from the... Um... That's right. She ran out of stuff to cook. She'd be nice to Catherine. So if you're playing up here and you're trying to get to know Catherine well... This Wahoo Beach, part of the Wahoo Beach run through is really for you. Oh, I know. Of course she works late, so we're just going to wait here. Uh, Alright, you know what? That might not be a good idea. Sometimes these guys teleport to where they need to be. Let's toddle up to the bar, and then we'll toddle back down if she's still. 
Okay, I mean, I can always eat cake. Yeah, alright, so let's grab some cake. We'll leave the pony out in front of the pub. It's not like I can't call him anyway. And right, we'll go and see. So Catherine works late in the shop. That I didn't know. She might be coming up now, though. Here she comes, just putting the flowers away. Oh, darling. Request? Thank you so much. It's not much. Oh, wow, your compost bin. But maybe you might find this useful. You're really welcome. And yes, I will find it useful. Alrighty, I wonder if Corin is still awake down at Wahoo Beach. We could, we could go check it out and see if he's there. Ooh, what's Becky? I know, that's the post box. We don't travel in that. Let's go to Spoonie. Uh, see if we can find anyone at Spoonie. Yep. Okay, it's going to be 2300. I think Corinne's probably going to be asleep. We'll just check anyway. You know what, we can poke him. Oh, no, he's still awake. Wow. Well, see that? I didn't know. Oops. Oh, then he works. All right, let's give him this cake. Good. Just for me. Julie, are uh, you sure? What you need? Hey Zora, what time is it? It's time for current to fix Meredith's AC. <laughs> All right, so no extra missions yet. A lot of these guys out at Spoonie are actually up really late. Um, except for they're not. All right, let's head on home. Back at Wahi Beach. It's 1 a.m. I think it's time we went to sleep. I don't think Jade is going to be there somehow. Why don't we check it out anyway? If she's still there, why don't we drop this thing off for her then? I know, I wrote I my pony in the bath. It. I suppose I must compensate you for your time. Please expect, accept this. There we go. So if you're late, you actually only get half the friendship points you would get then if you were on time. I know, we're, we're good. Boom. And it's the first day of winter. Look, everything's dead. It's dead, Jim. Go on, Smokey. Go to bed. Good girl. Man, I thought she was going to stand there all night. Let's, um... Alright, looks like I've got some cleaning up to do. First day of winter. I know, right? Bedtime. Let's let this little girl get some sleep. Best thing to do on a cold night. Snuggle up with your better half. Hey, I've received something in the mail. Did I ship anything? Alright, let's go and clean up these stalls. Alright, oh, I think he, he cleaned them up for me. Wow, what a good man. Uh, we probably need to clean up that... Um... Alright, we need to clean up the farms. We need to get our winter clothing. Our... So that will be fine. Let's get this shovel out. Boom. Pretty snow, and we'll actually also quit. <laughs> we'll put this away. There we go. Uh, all right, I'm gonna actually clean up these little edge corner bits too. Just, I know it's a waste of fertilizer, but it'll be fine. Um, and I haven't made any more pet food. I should do that because they're gonna run out soon. Or I could buy it. I could do that too. How much space is in my pack? Which reminds me. I need to grab another two batches of wheat. And put them in the windmills. Oh, if you just do it this way, you don't have to make it onerous with your windmills. You can just keep going. Don't pop them all in. Here we are. Whew. Okay. Let's just check out the... Okay, looks like there's still food in the dog food thing. Uh, did I clean up all the stables? No, I didn't clean up any of the stables because Kane got there first. What a good man. How much pet food have I got left? Uh-huh, enough probably for a day or so. Let's let everyone out of their stables. There we go. Now they'll be happy. It's an odd day. All right. 
We have no errands to run, except to go find our farm quota. Let's go buy the pet food first. And maybe go check our mail. Maybe eat some cake to run a bit faster. I know, right? Actually, I looked up those t-shirts. That's what I started saying. Uh, does Kane have sandwiches? They're probably in the other fridge. And uh, I discovered... Gabriel's products. Salmon burger. Alrighty. That, um... That there are a few things we can do. Uh, cookies and soup, apparently, can be eaten en masse. Uh, where are we going? Oh, the mailbox. Alright, oh, and the farm quota. That's what we're going to do. Sugar cane, lentil, celery, potato, milk, and white wool. Alright, let's go get that done. We could finish that, like, today. I think. Just see what's in the box. Wow. So much stuff. Alright, I'm la la la, not looking. You ponies are atrocious. Please hop out of the way. Okay. Sugar cane. Over here. How much sugar cane did they want? Farming. Okay. 140. That's not so bad. I think I've got some left. Yeah, here we go. We will give them 300 sugar cane because it will make them happy. Uh, lentils, maybe in this fridge. I've still got so many mushrooms. Oh, oh there's your lentils. Excellent. All right, it's just 140, so grab those. And I'm pretty sure it wants the celery, potato. Okay. Pretty sure the potatoes are in this fridge. Alright, there are some potatoes in this fridge. What about this fridge? We, we need to breadfruit something. Or we need to just sell it all. Oh, sorry, Snow. Alright, Kane's sandwiches need to go in my pack so I can actually feed him when I see him next. Uh, and I need to find my potatoes. Alright, that's my 140 potatoes. Salary. I may actually have to grow the celery. Oh, that'll be exciting. Yeah, see, I've only got 36. Well, I'll grab those because we can make 72 seeds out of it. Alright, what else do we need? Potatoes. Okay, lentils, celery, potato, milk and white wool. And all products fridge. I may have to go over to the other farm for this. Okay, fine. Just after... Okay, no, we do not need to go to the other farm for this. How much milk did they want? 150. There we go. We'll just toss that milk their way. Radio and white wool. Let's just go into the crafting recipes. Crafting menu over here. There we go. And one two hundred and fifty white wool. Beautiful. So we'll ship all of our, our quota stuff first. And then we'll worry about um, doing things in the other box. So I'll grab out all the insects again. And all of the fossils. We must just pick them up in batches. Sort that up to the top. Wow, that is a lot of rice we've got to. And then we'll get these things out of our backpack. Let's throw them. No, no, we want that for seeds. So I think the celery is the only thing we're going to have to grow this season. No, we're not selling cane sandwiches.
sort it all up. All right, that's that. Okay, anything? Ugh, pony, don't you dare go outside. Okay, we have to go do a check and see if our babies have arrived. I mean, he's put that pick, oh, that fertilizer barrel. We need to put that right down. Um, what was I doing? I was turning celery into celery seeds. That's what I was doing. Open that. All right, so these are my yeah. Maybe we're not using that barrel right now. We're using this barrel. Right, so while that preps up, we'll put our rasp, rasp, rasp and seeds in. My goodness. We have a bunch of stuff. I think I may have had celery seeds in here. No, so I would have had to get them. I'm going to put all of these in the shipping crate as well. Just to kind of, you know, keep shipping flowers. Oh, and the soup corn. Because I think I have soup corn seeds already. Gee, cook berry, cook berry. Ginger dragon, kratus, jello plant, jello plant. Healum tree, raskins, patarot, spin it, spin it. Tomatellon, Tomatellon, Zucon. Okay, I have a hundred Zucon seeds. We can afford to ship that last lot over there. Oh no, they're, they're all at the gate. Let, let me let you back in. There you go. Go on, Athena, move your little pony butt. Don't look at me like that. You, you're a cat in pony disguise, aren't you? I mean it. All right, fine. I'm not holding the gate open for you forever. Phew. Streperous creature. Uh, we're not shipping anything in here, are we? No. Fine. What am I doing? Shipping my Zucon. Feeding Pain a ham sandwich. Before it becomes a 100-day-old ham sandwich like the last lot. Where did I put Payne's hand sam ham, ham sandwiches? Excuse me, Ken. Let me go see if I um, shipped your ham sandwiches by mistake. I know, right? See, we can now make those pizza dishes for all that zucchini. No. Yes. I nearly shipped his ham sandwiches. Let's just ship the Zucor instead. What, what did I say about not shipping his ham sandwiches? Oh dear. Pain. Oh, yes, never mind. But you've got, you have, yes, you do. You're going to eat your ham sandwich and you're going to like it. Spectacular. There you go. Nothing more to say to me today. Wow. Wow, Kane. Wow. Okay, we're going to go off down to this other shipping crate. I'm going to eat some cake so I can move just a little bit faster. Right. Oh, no, we can even glide. Oh, sigh. <laughs> I know, right? Let's get these things away. So we're going to ship all of these flowers. Oh, that's right. We're shipping the kudamaki. I cooked a bunch of stuff and it all needs shipping. I think I shipped pretty much everything else. I just forgot that one. We can ship that. And we can ship that. Be careful. We're not shipping the bags of rice. Oh, right. All right, let's go and see if I need to clean up. I mean, I don't want to make everyone sick again. I've already done that once, once this series, or maybe twice. So we'll uh, we'll grab our shovel, wind it all down, and pick up the poop. Some days I feel like that's all I do. Okay, we'll pick up the eggs as well. I don't think that goat is sharing. He looks very defiant.
but I know I've got some winter trees somewhere too, so we still have to keep an eye on what's going on in here. That's right, it rained. I'm lucky they aren't sick. Okay, that's all done. All right. That is so much tidier. All right. Now, what were we going to do next? We were going to plant our celery seeds because they should be done now. Let's go get that done. I know, it's so peaceful. We've got our quota done. That was pretty good. Now you go through the gate. What? It wasn't good enough until I walked in. You know what, everybody? In, back in there, back in the sheds. You're all being menaces. And you know what I didn't do? I didn't buy the pet food. Just too busy chatting to Kane to, to, to worry about it. Let's see if he has any in stock today, because they don't always. I'll put that shovel away. I don't think he'll like it if I wave it at him too much. Let us buy animals. Find pet food. I know, I'm going to spend 6000 on pet food, but I don't think to. Alright, or maybe a little bit more. I have a million coins. It's not going to really hurt me at this point. Um, and I'm not building anything else, so we're good. Let's, let's fill, let's fill the, the pet food leader. I should probably go around and fill all of the feeders. Right, that's, that's all full. Uh, I need to put these. Back it up a little bit. This is the box. This is the box. Alright, so I've got some I've got some hay. Let's see if we, how much hay we can expend on the hay feeders. Yeah, I can probably do with buying some more hay. And then we can just top all the feeders up. Okay, I did forget to put that barrel down again. And the reason these guys are all inside is because we are making seeds. There we go. Alright, let's grab our, our thing. I'm gonna make a couple of garden beds. I mean, I should probably also plant some more potatoes. Make sure I'm on full health. Oh, plant all of that. Alright, I need to chocolate chip the rest of it though. Let us grab some of that. Quick that. Oh, I'm going to eat the salmon burger. I think it's pain made that specially for me. What a good man. I know she's waving, she feels so good about it that she's waving that fertilizer bag around like it's treasure. It is, I suppose, if you're gardening. And we'll grab the rest of these celery seeds, plant them in over here, and over here, and over here. Oh, grab this. Now, do I have, so I think potatoes are a winter seed as well, so we'll see if we've got any potatoes. These peanuts, when do they grow? Fall, I forgot about them. Oops. Next fall, we'll plant them, won't you, Zora? Whether or not we're still with you. Alright, I need to go turn some potatoes into seeds. Let's go do that. Now, what did I tell you, Tully, about sleeping on the bed? Quit it. Alright. I think a hundred potato seeds is enough. We'll just grab that. Because you know you know what Govin says about potatoes. He loves his potatoes and his curries and his lentils. Alrighty. We need to water these or they're never going to work. So, while that lot is going through, let's just water up these seed beds. Oh, I think all my daisies died and all of my 
other flowers die too because I forgot about them. You should harvest your flowers before. Um... Oh, these grow in winter. So good. I know, it's the bees are extremely happy. We need to get some more of those. I just don't want to dig some up to. Um... I suppose I could harvest them. Why don't we harvest some of our flowers here and we're going to extend those flower beds all along the back of the barns. I think that'll be really pretty. We won't take them all at once though or the bees will be upset. Whoa, that was a lot wasn't it? Sorry bees. And we'll chip it, chip it. And we'll water it. All right, don't fret bees. They'll be back, I promise. I know they're awesomely super pretty. Uh, and I've got a bunch of fish I need to process. So these things are worth 6G. So they're, they're quite a good, profitable. I must have had a small bag of potatoes. Oh no, I've already picked up potato seeds, I see. Alright, so these are my seeds. Let me just sort of things so I can find them. So I've got a couple of bags there. Well, let's go. Make sure my health is full as well. I'll eat the crab stuffed mushrooms. I know, right? Wow, Tully. Is that? No, it's not Tully. Which one of you is that? You, yes. Evil puppy. All right, we're out of celery. Let us equip a bag of potatoes. Eat the crab salad. Yum yum. Okay, we're super duper. Let's go. That was hard work, wasn't it, Zora? All right, 9:32. That looks pretty good. That does. Let's let her get some sleep. That'll do. Microphone. It's well away from me again. Hopefully I haven't been too soft this session as a result. There we go. A lot to keep going. What do we have today? Nothing in my mailbox. Alright, so we're going to go and bug Govind as soon as we can because I just... I'm sure it's been 18 days. Surely. Tadpoles. Wow, thanks. And you watered the crops. Nice. Thanks. Well, in return for your grilled tuna, gave me tadpoles. Oh man, I wish they had done more with that. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. So what we're going to do is uh, we're going to go visit Corrin. And I know I'm going to take my, that's tungsten. We will take an iron bar with us. Or five. There. Fifty. That should be enough. We'll go put some of this um, baking stuff in the baking fridge so that it's out of our pack. We can make a ton of bread with that later. Oh, where are we at? Put that up there. I might hang on to these. For the minute. I mean, I don't know how many how many flower seeds I'm going to need. I know. Is he watering? He's watering my crops. What a good man. I know. I'm going to come around here one day, and my good man will have harvested 
everything and I'll be very cross with him. Uh, oh, right, while we're here. Let's just clean up all of this. There we go. Clean snow. Let's place this. Right, now I have three of them. If I ever need that many. Like that. Put that one in there. Put that one in there. And put that one in there. Well, speak of little angels. I'll sigh. I, you know, these empty bowls are really starting to bother me, so I'm going to grab this and we just run around and we might fill their bowls as well. Did I send everyone in? I did. I sent them inside while I planted yesterday. I should let them out again. But all the crops are watered. That's pretty good. Ruffles, yes. I think I saw them yesterday and then didn't pick them up. So I know it's not like me to leave a thousand G lying on the ground. But there you go. We should make some truffle chocolates. Hey, I know I'm looking for babies, but if there were any, they'd be male. I've just received something in the mail. All right. Well, let's go and see what that is. Because I, I can't think of... Oh, no, that would be my shipping stuff. Then we'll go visit Govind and see if we've if the horses need breeding again. Because I'm, I know I bred them, but... Sigh. It'll be fine. Fine. Oh. Payment. And bonuses. No payment. Oh, there's our bonuses. Wow, that is that is a lot of bonus. Oh, whoops, I skipped right past that. Old letters. So maybe that one? Okay, 1157, 1130. All right, I must have, I just must have skipped right on past that very last, that very last letter. So. Two, three, four, or it's been sorted out of order. Oh, wait, maybe it's down the bottom. Okay, sugar cane. that one there we go and there's our seeds see out there hustler i like seeing that in my town it looks like these are hy the last hybrid crop seeds i can give you i think my cousin said the mainland defunded his research or something darn shame well from this point forward all i can give you is some extra gold to keep up the hard work that was the letter i missed all right so what did he give us sugar nut tree seeds all right so does that mean we've found all of the different special seeds in the game? I think it might. All right, well, that leaves us. I know, where am I going to put them? It leaves us planting our, um, our rainbow seeds. And our potato seeds, maybe. Because I haven't let my animals out yet. So let's uh, let's go do that. Let's go plant up our plant up our um our rainbow seeds so we can have that beauty along the back of the barn. So I love it in there. Make sure I'm fully 
What? Okay, I got something else in the mail. I wonder if that means our folds have arrived. That'd be kind of cool. Uh, let's eat something before we plant any more. Crab legs look good. Oh no, I um, chose fish as my favourite food, so they give me all the fishy foods. That's it. I've got to get some more. Okay, let's go and... Um, let's go check the mail. But first, maybe, maybe that's my foals arriving. I don't know. Let's go find out. I don't pierce through the windows. Why don't you just go into the stables, girl? <gasps> yes. Oh, yes. All right. I know. I, I didn't want the letter to spoil it, but here we go. This. This is our little unicorn foal. What are we going to call it? It's a rainbow. It's... We'll call all the unicorns can have a cloud in their name. So we're going to call this one Cloud Jumper. There we go. Beautiful. Look at this. This is our baby unicorn foal. And we're going to brush it because that is so cool. Oh, and a second one. Oh my gosh. Well, it's not going to be called Jimmy. It's going to be called Cloud Dancer. There we go. We shall brush, brush the foal. Come on, brush the foal. Add the foal. So Cloud Jumper, Cloud Dancer. All right, we didn't get a rainbow sheep out of this one. So we're not calling it fried. We're going to call it boy brown because it's brown and a boy. And we're going to sell it. And this, we did, did we get? Uh, let's cancel that. I'm going to leave that in its thing. I think that's a pink pig and not a, not a truffle pig, though. A little brown foal. You guys know how to welcome a foal to the stable, don't you? Okay, girl brown is going to be sold. But uh, there you go. At least she didn't poop. We're going to brush her as well. because She's a good pony. Alright, two rainbow folds is pretty good. We didn't get a third? No, look at that. But we got a nice variety of colours. We got... boy brown what oh okay boy brown too <coughs> and then we have tonkatsu no we're gonna call her girl white because harmonica is the pony we're keeping <coughs> And then we have Boy Grey. I know, because I don't want to be tempted to, to keeping them. Do I own a grey horse? I no, I own Smokey. What am I on? But I know, did I just I'm sorry, did I pat you? I did. I patted you with a sickle. No wonder you aren't impressed. Little unnamed. Stanley. No, we're calling you Boy Brown 3. And we're going to give you a nice welcome brush and a welcome pat. Pat the cat. The cat is clearly cruising. The cat is leaving. <sighs> that. I know. I've got to clean up this stable. I cannot end the series on it on a dirty stable. We have to, we have to not do that. I'm going to go and plant my rainbow flowers. Um, but that, that concludes the goals that we had for this series, which were to breed one of each special animal. Oh, actually, we need to go see if that pig is a mushroom pig or if it's a, um, a pink pig. So the goals were to breed one of each special animal 
which we've now finally managed to do. That took us a bit. To fill the museum to 100%, to cook one of each recipe and discover one of each recipe. Man, that could it was being. And to craft one of each craftable item and we have we have managed to do all of that I'm pretty sure that is a pink pig um, and not a not a mushroom pig so that also answers our other question you're not guaranteed having a mushroom pig if you breed a mushroom pig to a um, to a normal pig and you're not guaranteed having a rainbow sheep if you breed a normal sheep to a rainbow sheep but I wasn't sure of it until just then. Wow, Cloud Jumper, did you have to join the party? You did. I know, your first day here and you're already pooping up the stable. Look at you. When they mature into adults, uh, I think they get their horns. I could be wrong. There we go. We'd have to check with, um, with Camille. Alrighty. That's these guys all cleaned up. We were going to get the rest of our um, our seeds out of the seed bucket. I have a feeling I'm actually going to need another batch of seed. So we're going to do that. I know, I'm kind of excited, but I'm kind of sad too, because end of the series, did I send these guys outside? No, because I was, because I was very busy making sure I could plant stuff before they escaped. And flowers. And water. It's, we're not cooking, we're just making a garden. It's kind of cooking. So if I want to put beehives down, I'm going to have to accept that I'm not going to get, um, yeah, that I'm going to have to hoe up some of my, some of my flowers, harvest some of my flowers. Alrighty, let's chocolate chip this space. Here we go. I know, I'm kind of excited because it this this means this is the last episode of this series. Um I'm kind of sad because we're seeing the series go, but I'm excited because we get to go and, and see Bailey now and see what it's like to to finish finish up Diamond Falls in um in the full release version. Because when we started Diamond Falls, it was in early access and it's early access all the way to episode 30 uh, it only goes into full release at episode 31 so there are there are going to be some changes we need to explore for Bailey um, that happened on on the full release version that she won't have seen yet all right let's let's get these flowers in because we might as well leave the farm with the potential for pretty and we'll let uh, Zora and Zane. Oh, that was close. Zora and Zane. Let's eat your ice cream, Zora. Man, you deserve it. Um, and Kane, continue on without us. Let's go get some more seeds. What I'm aiming for is this beautiful flower effect on the on the back of the barn walls, which happens when the um, when the rainbow flowers grow through. So we might as well leave Zora with that as our gift for her. All right.
Uh, I'm gonna eat Jabala's chicken. Yeah, we'll eat that. Poor oh, Jabala. It's alright. You made chicken color blue. Where is it? It was delicious. See, now we know why he's such a happy man because because chicken dishes make you happy. Alrighty, we're gonna go and check our mail. Well, there you go, Zora. And um, yeah, wow, our unicorn falls arrived and our series is over. Let's see what we found. Baby unicorn, baby tanfall, baby grayfall, baby whitefall, baby tanfall, baby pink piglet. It is a pink piglet. There you go. Baby tanfall, baby unicorn fall, and a baby brown lamb. All right. Outside. Well, guys, on that note, as the sun sets over Wahoo Beach. Um, and Zora heads for home for some quiet celebrating with Kane. Look at this. You get to see a sunset. It's beautiful. That is where we're going to leave you. Take care out there, guys. And I will see you around.